In October 1972, a Uruguayan rugby team was traveling to a game in Chile when their plane crashed in the Andes Mountains. A group of 45 passengers and some crew were left stranded at 12,000 feet, without food, warm clothing, or any hope of rescue. They were forced to turn to the unthinkable to survive, eating the bodies of those who had died in the crash. After more than a week, the survivors realized that no rescue was coming and that they needed to take matters into their own hands. Two of the group, Nando Parado and Roberto Canessa, set out on foot to find help. They trekked through the snow and over mountains, battling extreme cold and hunger. After 10 days, they came across a Chilean shepherd who called for help. A rescue team was sent, but their first attempt was unsuccessful due to poor weather conditions. The survivors had to endure another 10 days before a second rescue attempt was made. Finally, on December 23, 1972, the remaining 14 survivors were airlifted to safety.